We're in a new chapter now, Patterns and Numbers to 100. This is Patterns with 10, Lessons 3.1. We have 110, it's a 1 and a 0. 2 tens is a 2 and a 0. 3 tens is a 3 and a 0. Can you see the pattern? Can you see how the 1's place is a 0 and the numbers are counting 1, 2, 3? There is 1 in the tens place and 0 in the 1's place. We have 10. 1, 10. Now there's a 2 in the tens place and 0 in the 1's place. We have 2 tens. We have 20. We have 3 tens and 0 1's. Now we have 30. We have four tens and zero ones. We have 40. We have five tens and zero ones. We have 50. We have six tens and zero ones. We have 60. We have seven tens and zero ones. We have 70. We have eight tens and zero ones. We have 80. We have nine tens and zero ones. We have 90. Now here's the tricky one. If we have 10 tens and zero ones, we have 100, 100. But we're not supposed to put two digits in one box. We're not supposed to do that. We have 100 zero tens and zero ones. One, zero, zero, 100, zero tens, zero ones, that's 100. Just remember to put one digit in each box, okay? If you get another digit, you go to the next box, all right? And there's a lot of them. I have a chart of the place values up here, and you can see there's a 1, a 10, 100, and look at how far it goes, and it keeps going and going. There's even more than this. Now I want to show you these. This yellow one, that's a cube, that's one unit. This is a rod of 10 cubes. It's also called a long of 10 cubes. And we can count by tens. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Now, if you look at these, you can see the pattern. All the ones places are zero, and the tens places count up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten for 100. And we can count by tens. We have three rods of 10, so we count 10, 20, 30. It's a three zero, it's a 30. We have five tens, we count by 10, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Five tens, zero ones, we have a five zero, that's 50. We have two tens, 10, 20. Two tens, zero ones, a two, then a zero, 20. In this one, we have seven tens and zero ones. We can count by 10, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. It's a seven and a zero, it's 70. In this one, we have nine tens and zero ones. We can count by tens, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 
80, 90. It's a 9 and a 0, it's 90. Now if you don't have rods like this to help you count by tens, you can make your own. You can make your own rod of ten. You can take a piece of paper with lines on it and you can count ten boxes, ten lines, and draw a line on the eleventh one. And you can take a scissors and cut them and make your own rods of ten. You can use each one of these to represent a ten, okay? You can also try to buy these, okay? You can buy those online. Rods of 10 and base 10 units for learning, okay? So that's how we count with 10 and those are the patterns of 10 that all the ones places are zeros and the tens places count up. I'll see you next video. Bye.